This is Bill Danoff of the Starland Vocal Band. This is Taffy Danoff of Starland Vocal Band. This is John Carroll of the Starland Vocal Band. This is Margo Chapman of Starland Vocal Band. Join me on What's It All About with Bill Huey. Huey. <laughs> 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 and this is Bill Huey, and I'm not with the Starland Vocal Band. But we'll have a look at and talk with this hot new singing group in just a moment on What's It All About. Gonna find my baby, gonna hold her tight, gonna grab some afternoon delight. My motto's always been when it's right, it's right. Why wait until the middle of a cold, dark night? When everything's a little clearer in the light of day. And we know the night is always gonna be here anyway. Purveyors of one of the freshest singing styles around, the Starland Vocal Band isn't exactly a long-term project. It was formed only two years ago, when Bill and Taffy, who had been recording with John Denver, went into a studio and, well, Taffy can explain it better. Bill and I had an act for uh, a long time. We were first called Fat City, and then we were Bill and Taffy, which is our real names. We met John in 1970 and had done a lot of work and recording with him since then. And uh, Starline Vocal Band started two years ago in February when Bill and I were going to do a single session for RCA. And we were going to get Margo and John, both of whom are from musical groups in Washington, D.C., to do background vocals on the single. And then Billy got the idea very late one night, as long as we're going to do that and really go for beautiful music, maybe Bill and Taffy and Margo and John should be a group so that everyone can share equally. The group kicked around for a year on John Denver's Wind Song label. Then last year, success happened. They gave America the year's most coy sexual euphemism, selling over one million copies of Afternoon Delight. The song's inspiration was innocent enough. Bill and Margot were in a bar in Washington, D.C., and they were hungry and thirsty, so they, they ordered a drink, and then they wanted to see a menu. So the waiter brought out a menu, and at the top of the menu, it said, Afternoon Delights. And Billy said, Bingo! I've been up on this highway for five days in a row. My words all run together and my feet are moving slow. I gotta stop and eat while it's still light. There's a local angel sitting on my right. Do you believe in love at first sight? Baby. Look good to me Titles like Afternoon Delight and Baby You Look Good to Me Tonight, notwithstanding, the Starland Vocal Band isn't a congregation of sex fiends. In fact, they feel sex is dealt with too blatantly in today's music. Right now, I think there's a, a big uh, sex book in pop music of all the things in the top 40. So when you open the trade magazines, like Billboard magazine, Record World magazine, and you'll see an ad for a record and it's very lewd looking. I mean, it's pornography. Just taking for an example, our record, when it was released, uh, at first some stations wouldn't play it. We thought, hey, that's neat. You know, it's going to be controversial. They won't play it. That'll make the record hotter even. You know, that's neat. But then you hear uh, other records, and they're not as uh, tasty and, and tame as, say, Afternoon Delight. It's about the same thing, and some people just come out blatantly and say it, and that's that gets played more, it seems. Because yeah, we've been inundated right. with, with nothing, all of that stuff, yeah, and it's nothing's getting to be anymore. pretty boring. As with any of God's gifts, sight, hearing, intelligence, talent, sex is an instrument to be used or abused. We can always pervert God's blessings, using our sight to shoot and kill our fellow human being, or using intelligence to mislead and fool others. But these same blessings are great sources of our pleasure and betterment. Such is the case with sex. It is one of God's great gifts, one of his many ways of allowing us to share in the joy of his creation. And that's what it's all about. To be blessed. 